All right, Smokey Rob here, uh, America's Chief Grilling Officer, and we're at the New Orleans Lunchbox. We're going to try their uh, barbecue. We've heard some good things about it. I've heard they've got really good brisket and ribs, and we're going to try the, as we always do, all the meats. Uh, see how good it is. Again, it's a barbecue place that's in a gas station, so I'm all excited about it. So I'll see you inside. Okay, right, Smokey Rob here. We're inside the uh, New Orleans lunchbox. We got the coyote platter. We've got the ribs. We've got the brisket. It's like it's kind of a chopped, burned-in brisket. We've got the pulled pork, and we've got the quartered chicken. And then also because they have, you know, world-famous wings that they've won some some awards for, I had to try the wings too. So we're going to start. We're going to start out with the ribs. We're going to do the bite test. And the bite test, again, uh, where I bite, I expect just that part to come off. That tells me it's a totally done rib. If all of it comes off, then it's overdone. If it doesn't come off at all, it's underdone. Yeah, I kind of bit a little bit far that way, but yes, it came off good. I dropped the bone. So it's just about perfectly done. Oh, wow, it's got a good smoke flavor to it. It's got a good, got a good bark on it. It's um, not an overpowering rub on it. Not too salty. That's very good. Hmm. I like that rib. All right, so let's um, let's try the the beef then. Wow, well, look at the bark on that. See, and the bark on the back of that. Have this. So, wow. So it's very tender, very done. Wow. That's good. That's got the good smoke flavor to it. That's a good bark on the outside. Got a hint of salt. Um, that's that's probably the the best beef brisket I've had in North Alabama. Now, I mean, um, you know, as opposed to going all the way to Texas for it, that's really good. Um, I like the snow. You have a good day, man. That is good beef brisket. Wow. All right, let's try the, the pork. We're doing really well with our so far. Let's see if I can find a piece of bark on that one. There's a little bit of bark on the on the beef brisket, the bark. Yep. I said beef brisket, I meant pork. That beef brisket saw my mind. That's the pork. Wow, very another similar smoky flavor to it also. It's a good flavor. It's uh don't taste a lot of rub on it, which is good. It's a, but it's got a good, nice taste. It's got a good pork flavor to it, not like a boiled meat flavor. So I like that. Um, so we're doing pretty good so far. Everything's doing good. So let's see what we can do with the chicken. I got the uh, quarter dark meat. We're going to just take a bite out of it somewhere. And then bite out of it over here. It's also very good too for uh, smoked chicken. Uh, you taste the smoke on it. Uh, yeah, it's not a lot of uh, rub on it. This is overpowering you. There's some very good flavor on that. Oh, that's good chicken also. All right, we're gonna try the we're gonna try the wings and that's a nice drum there. Uh, skins not too rubbery. Good. Very good smoke flavor. Very similar to the uh, to the chicken chicken. Um, that's a good wing also. So I'm very happy with everything I've had so far. Um, so here, the New Orleans Lunchbox. Um, if you're ever here and it's on Jordan Lane in Huntsville, Alabama, check it out for lunch or dinner. Um, Smokey Rob saying, stay smoky.